Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. We got some cars to show you right there. Uh, it's a mail call I just received. I actually just made a video um, earlier in the day, but uh, something happened with one of the with one of the cars, and uh, yeah, I decided just to make another video. I want to show you that car because it's still awesome, and there's a good story behind it. But uh, yeah, so basically what happened is, uh, well, not what happened. Basically what I did was I sent uh, a few of these cars to my buddy. Uh, hold on a second. I'm going to pull up uh, pull up his Instagram here. Get you guys, uh, show you guys. Uh, he's, a, he's a guy who does customs. Uh, toxic underscore customs with a K and a Z at the end there. Uh, you can check him out on Instagram. But uh, once upon a time, I seen him make a custom and it was exactly like my lifted truck, my lifted F-150. So I ended up, um, I ended up uh, purchasing that off of him and then uh, he, sent, uh, he sent me this truck too with it and, uh, and I ended up breaking one of the wheels off of it. So I ended up sending him a bunch of other cars to just do the wheel swaps and a couple tiny little things. And yeah, so I just got him back uh, so I'm going to show them to you guys. So yeah, here we go. Uh, I'm going to show you guys this truck first. Um, it's a pretty cool truck. So I broke the wheel off this and then I sent it back to him and he fixed it. So that was cool. Let's zoom in a little bit. Um, it's basically a Matchbox um, Ford Raptor. You can see the Matchbox on the back fender there. Um, and he put this sick lift on it. Did some details in the front. And, uh, yeah, I really like it. Um, I got the RLC Ford Raptor here. And, uh, I think I like this one better. Obviously, this one has an opening hood and, you know, and all that stuff. But, uh, I like this one better. It has the, the side mirrors that's lacking it. But, uh, you know, I like a good Raptor. And it's cool because this is a, I believe this is the older Raptor, right? Yeah, this is an older Raptor and that's a newer Raptor. So they kind of go, they kind of go good together. I think they look uh, kind of cool together. All right. So that's the, that's the one I, uh, I got fixed. Um, all right. I'm going to show you guys this, uh. Just did a wheel swap on this. I like the rim choice. I told him to pick out whatever rims he felt like because uh, I trust his taste. And the fresh license plate there. That's pretty sweet. Um, I got the stock one here. And I love how uh, you know a good wheel swap, a good choice of wheel swap uh, will make a car. Feels rolls so much better too with the rubber tires. All right, cool. Put that back. All right, next we'll show you this Lamborghini. So this is pretty sweet. Um, this is a uh, Elemento. So that's pretty sweet. I got a couple of other ones. Um, the Hot Wheels has put out, they do a pretty good job with Lambos, um, you know, and a good wheel swap just finishes it right up. Oh, look at that. That's just badass. I love it. There we go. These ones are pretty badass too. This uh, red and gray one is pretty sick. Lime green. Yeah, I like that. All right. And then the last one. Boom. Look at that. Zoom in a little bit. Look at those gold rims. That is, that's a good choice of rim. This Kintosh is so sick. And obviously, we got this here to compare. 
should have took it out of this thing, but it's a pain in the ass. Plus, you guys have seen it. <coughs> so it's not that much different, to be honest with you. Uh, you know, besides the opening door, it's just the casting itself. It's pretty, it's pretty much the same. But it's cool. I like this. Okay, and then I got one more to show you guys. This one back. All right, so this is the custom uh, that he made, especially for my daughter. And uh, it actually got damaged in the shipping. And I'm gonna show it to you guys. This is an F50. All right, looks pretty sweet. And then he wrote my daughter's name across there. But, uh, so it was uh, being shipped on this uh, M2, originally an M2 thing here where he customized, and this is actually his logo in the corner here, made it all nice, um, screwed it all down, and in the shipping, I guess, uh, it got tossed around, and it came off the base and got uh, tossed around a little bit. And you can see that tire up there. Tire actually came off. And um, and uh, you you can see all the marks. It actually cracked the uh, the plastic there. You can see, and uh, the paint got damaged all over the place. So uh, you can see here all the paint where it got banged up. So uh, yeah, it was uh, pretty bad, and uh, and we had insurance. So this might be a, a little bit of advice here. Um, I probably would never buy insurance on anything like that anymore just because like they they're not gonna pay you guys anything they asked us if the box was damaged clearly the box wasn't showing any kind of damage it was definitely tossed around that's why that happened and you figured that they would probably cover it but they're gonna ask us to do a bunch of crazy shit that i'm not gonna do um for it um you know i appreciate the effort uh and uh and how i know all this is uh because he actually called me so uh this guy lives in the states and he, he called me and uh, to tell me that uh that you know this is what the post office wanted us to do and blah blah it, it's cool that he even went out of the way to try to figure all that out you know what i mean obviously uh he put a lot of hard work into the the one custom for my daughter you know by put, making that custom case and you know, uh, with her name on the back. It looks really, really good too. Um, you know, I appreciate all the effort there. So I told him not to worry about it, but uh, he wants to fix it. So he's gonna fix it all up. But you know, that's cool. You know, I got people that owe me money that don't even send me a text, you know, to tell me that they don't got the money and for me to wait. And you know, and this guy here, you know, this is just die cast. And you know, this guy's uh, super nice. And you know, honestly, this guy's pretty cool guy. I've been, I talked to him been talking to him for the, the last year and you know we even shared uh pictures of our kids so obviously you know we we're cool um and he's a super super good guy and you know i, I didn't uh, expect any less from him and uh you know and i appreciate uh all the awesome uh all the awesome cars he makes all right guys uh thanks for tuning in um i was gonna do a free to piece but you know i showed you guys a couple pieces I already freed earlier, so I guess it, this could count as free to peace anyways. I'm always freeing some, you know. All right. Take care, guys. Thank you for watching. Um, have a happy New Year's if I don't make another video, all right? And if, I, if you guys aren't watching that other video, whatever. All right, guys. Peace.